China issuing a warning after the U.S. military staged the largest ever drills with the Philippines. Uh, the CCP in a statement says the drills, quote, should not target any third party and should be conducive to regional peace and stability. Congressman, you were part of the congressional delegation to Taiwan. Assess the China threat and these drills. Well, that statement is comical in light of the fact that they uh, performed drills uh, surrounding the island of Taiwan while I and my colleagues were there. Uh, China is our greatest geopolitical foe. And when you look at their conduct and the, and the naked aggression that they have engaged in, including flying a Chinese spy balloon over the continental United States unimpeded, collecting sensitive data over our military bases, uh, they are a threat. Uh, and the United States and the Biden administration needs to take that uh, threat seriously. We need to be working with our allies, specifically Japan, South Korea, the Philippines, uh, Australia, Thailand and Taiwan. Uh, you know, 60 percent of international trade comes through the Strait of Taiwan. Over 90 percent of semiconductors are manufactured in Taiwan. And Taiwan is our eighth largest trading partner. Uh, China needs to understand that any provocations, any potential invasion of Taiwan uh, or blockade in the Strait of Taiwan is not only unacceptable, but will be met with uh, economic sanctions and force. Yeah. And one of the lessons that must be learned from the Russian invasion of uh, Ukraine is that we need to deter China early, which means we need to arm Taiwan. We need to get the weapons that they have purchased uh, manufactured and to them as quickly as possible. And the Biden administration has been asleep at the switch on this. Well, I mean, and they need to get serious about it quick. 